my name is dolaram uh, uh, my demonstration is uh, on the magnetic amplifier so the idea of this demonstration is to demonstrate that we can control the high power ac using the low power dc high power ac current can be uh, as much as uh, as high as a uh, uh, 100 ampere 1000 uh, ampere and uh, dc current can be as low as uh, around 1 uh, or 2 ampere so that way we have a huge gain around, around of uh, 100 2000 the the main idea we are exploiting here is that we can change the inductance of the inductor by uh, injecting the dc field in the inductor core so by injecting the uh, controlling that dc field injected into that inductor we can control the its inductance uh, if you apply uh, low dc field to that inductor core then its uh, permeability and uh, its inductance will be uh, very high for example in this this initial condition is what happen is that you uh, i am applying the very much uh, low dc current to the dc bending of the this inductor so its inductance at this instant will be very high so drop across this will be a, this will be a very high so since th these two are in series uh, and so the voltage across this bulb will be very low if i somehow increase this uh now i have increased the this dc current uh, that is given to this uh, dc field uh, of the uh, this core now what happens is that uh, that will uh, uh, shift this operating point to where there uh, where we have a, a low uh, relative permeability so its inductance will be decreased if in, its inductance will be decreased voltage across drop across this will be, will be decreased and we have a uh, increase in the voltage across this bulb if we further increase then uh, inductance will be further dropped and output voltage across this will be a further increase i so that i can have in that way i can have a control over from 0 to high voltage i am controlling it in uh, from 0 voltage to uh, 12 volt in that way i have a uh, output voltage control over from 0 to uh 240 volt the this is a very old idea uh, uh the idea of, uh it is uh, it, uh, when there was a uh, no semiconductor devices available at that time it was used uh, used and nowadays uh, the, uh, the th those semiconductor devices almost replaced in the many applications uh, uh, th to this uh, magnetic amplifier but this uh, magnetic amplifier is still used in a many application for example where you have a very harsh environment for example in the military applications uh, uh, in the, in, for example you want to fly a uh, missiles you have a lot of vibrations over there there you cannot use that semiconductor devices there uh, you have there this idea uh, of the magnetic amplifier is still used another uh, um, application we have in a nuclear reactor for example inside a reactor you want to control uh, something or control rod or something else there this uh, the device is subjected to a high vibration sorry high radiation that high radiation can cause very much uh, damage uh, or uh, the, those semiconductor devices cannot operate in very much reliably uh, on that uh, that uh, environment so this idea is still used in a in the in that nuclear application so this is all about this demonstration